What you got, man? You can't eat through the wrapper. You don't get sick, man. He wants to eat it so bad. Oh, right there! Right <laughs> He's like, how do you get through this? Does that mean there's more? Oh, maybe it's too bad. You know that. Boom. Why are you going so quiet? It's not. The place comes now, wing! <laughs> He's like, wait. He's like, look at all this food. I want to record him eating. Don't do it. <laughs> he just likes to run. <laughs> that wasn't swift. Right? Look at mine. I know. Ow! Ow! <laughs> She's okay. just kidding with you, man. Just... <laughs> God. He's never gonna, he's gonna sleep with that thing. <laughs> Alright, I think that's enough candy, man. This is ridiculous. Ah, oh, brothers. Brothers. Sorry, I haven't been on as much. Uh, I've been really busy with Easter and the kids, and we had Easter dinner at our house, so I cooked. But and I was injured, so I haven't been working out as hard. I've been doing mostly cardio and calisthenics. I haven't uh, done much weight training, but today I'm going to do a really quick uh, weight circuit. You guys can uh, watch me and maybe give this a try. I got a new piece of equipment too. Hold on one second. Let me get it. I'm excited. I haven't got one of these, so I'm going to do weighted chin-ups and weighted dips in my circuit today. I'm only going to use a 25-pound plate because I'm still a little bit injured. I pulled something right here in my pec and in my shoulder. So I'm going to go easy on it with the 25-pound, but I'm excited to, excited to get this thing worked into my routines. Also, I wanted to ask everybody um, how they deal with their kids and candy. You know, I'm not really a big fan of sugar. I used to be a huge fan of sugar. And I actually found myself throwing a lot of candy away. My kids got Easter baskets from my mother-in-law, Easter baskets from me and my wife, and from my parents. Plus a lot of extra candy. It was just so much candy. And I, I'm all for kids having fun. I know kids are going to eat candy sometimes. But I think they really, really went overboard the past few days. And now that's all my son wants to eat is candy, candy. He has candy stashed all over the house. I feel like I'm on an Easter egg hunt, finding candy in the couch. This, this all this dude wants to eat is eat candy now. He won't even eat breakfast. So, how how much is too much for you guys? I mean, I, I'll show you in this video. I'm throwing stuff away, which my old self would have probably fought, punched myself in the face. My bigger self, if I saw somebody throwing away a Reese's cup, oh man. But I threw away a lot of candy because I just don't want my kids to be used to. It. That should be a treat. I don't think. I don't know if everybody will agree with me on this, but I don't think kids should be. And the candy's not made the same way, I feel like, as it was when we were kids. There's a lot of extra chemicals and stuff. I read the back of that thing. It's not just chocolate. There's all kinds of weird shit in there. And I know kids are going to be kids. They're going to eat candy. But I'd like to hear other people's opinions on this. I think it should be a treat. I don't think it should be an everyday thing. Maybe after dinner, I let my son have ice cream. But I, want, I try to get healthy options. 
I don't try to like I don't like refined sugars. I don't think that anybody should really eat refined sugars, maybe on occasion. But I tried to eat a peep, and I ate some pie, and man, did I'm so not used to eating that stuff that I really got sick. It kind of ruined the two days for me, man. I felt sick to my stomach. That's how against my body's like fighting against it or something. I felt like. I don't know. I'm rambling on here. I'm going to get on with the workout. hope you guys enjoy the video. And I hope you guys enjoyed the footage that I put up uh, of us just a little bit from our Easter holiday. And uh, yeah, let's get going. <laughs>
Whew. Yeah, so it was a pretty tough workout. I haven't hit the weights uh, in a few days, like a week. I've been doing all calisthenics, like I said. And uh, I had to squeeze in, 30 minute workout. Definitely got the job done, full body workout. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I always hear people give excuses. They don't have enough time, they don't have enough time. But think about how much time in a day do you spend looking at your phone? How much time do you spend watching TV? How much time do you spend on Facebook? Because it really only takes, I mean, you don't have to be a serious bodybuilder to want to work out just to get healthy. You only need 20, 30 minutes, man. Even sometimes I'll do a 10 minute workout. It's just however, you just got to prioritize, man. You got to get healthy, especially before you get older, man. Because I've, I've, I mean, I've had relatives as well as uh, clients when I was a personal trainer. Like, man, I wish I would have started. Like they wait till their doctor tells them something's wrong and then they go try to get healthy. By that time, sometimes it's too late. My own grandmother, they kept telling her to stop smoking, start exercising. She needed a heart operation. She said, I didn't want to, she didn't want to do it. She didn't want to stop smoking. 10 years later, they're like, you're going to die. You could die any day. And she's, she's on her deathbed. And she's like, I want the operation now. I'll stop smoking. They said, Hey, it's too late now. And she died. She died painfully. And it was terrible. My mother had to watch it. I couldn't even go visit her, man. It was so sad because I loved that woman so much. I couldn't even watch it. So don't do that to yourself. Sorry to get a little deep on you guys, but I'm just, uh, I want to make this channel to help people, man. I'm, if you have any questions about any of these moves, sometimes I forget that I've been doing this a long time and I forget to make, to break down the moves for people that are just starting out. So if you have any questions, how these moves are performed, I'll make a video and show you how any one of my moves is performed and show you the proper technique because technique is everything. Who cares how much weight you can put up if you don't have the right technique, you end up injuring yourself. So I hope all you guys, sorry about getting uh, deep on you guys, but I was just thinking about that, thought I'd put that on the video. And I got a lot of videos to edit. I just haven't been, uh, I've been so busy. I haven't had time to get them all up, but I hope you guys are uh, had a good Easter and I'll see you guys on the next video. What you giving, that's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed. I hear a lot of people talking like they politicians and choose to be an accountant because it's safe in the business.